I'm going to help you to be able to set up your own music website fast, f free if you'd like, and very effectively so you can start sharing your music with the world. I'm really excited to be able to help you out. I have made my own music website and I'm going to show you step by step how to do that. So as you see on the screen here, this is my website, djshansbeats.com. And as an example here, I have my logo up here at top. I have my sale here, but I have my music store where people can come in and buy beats instantly. And all I have to do is sit back and watch it come into my PayPal account and they get their um, music sent to them instantly. So this is great if you're a beat maker, a music producer, I'll show you how to set that up. Or if you're just a music artist, I'll also help you to be able to just set up a music page uh, so that you can share your music and maybe sell it as well. I have a little mobile store button here so those who are on the mobile devices, uh, which is actually very common nowadays of course, uh, you know, they could just click this button and I'll show you real quick. It'll open up full screen on their phone or their tablet. It'll be a lot easier experience. You know, they won't click away from my site if this is what they see on their phone. Uh, I also have a licensing chart here. This is more for beat uh, makers and producers if they're selling the beats. Uh, so not totally necessary. Then I have a frequently asked questions button that takes them to uh, a different page also on my website of frequently asked questions just to uh, really help your customers uh, as much as possible. I do have a little testimonial section coming soon. Again, this is optional, but testimonials will really help uh, new visitors to have faith and trust in your product and in your music. So something to keep in mind as well. We'll go over that later. And then lastly, I have an email opt-in form, which is going to be very crucial to your online music business to really keep people coming back to your website. We're going to cover that as well. I have a short little question to really help explain to new visitors what the website's about. Have some nice little keywords in there to kind of help out with ranking in Google. I have my little PayPal and Stripe buttons to give people confidence that they can shop on my website and I also have my social media buttons because that's going to play a huge part in how you promote your music. Up top I have a couple different pages as well. I'll show you how you could set up some pages besides your main website like a blog for example to just bring in more customers because ultimately what's a website if you don't have anybody coming to it, right? So I'm going to go through and run by all these things step by step. I'm going to guide you along the way to help you to create your own successful music website, okay? So stick around, go on to the next video, and we'll take it from there.